We spent an entire day in the woods building a primitive winter survival shelter. A subscriber challenged us to cook this four ingredient meal with apples? A surprise guest showed up and turned our little fire into this raging fire. Will it burn down our shelter? Come along for the ride and find out. Now we're gonna let it sit for an hour, maybe two hours. That just allows the snow to really compress. If we were to dig it out right now, uh, it would kind of all collapse. I worked up an appetite. So we're gonna get a fire started and uh, cook some food. Hmm, I just broke my ferro rod. That sucks. I guess I used it too much. Let's see if I can use just this little piece here though. We did it with a broken ferro rod. In the last video, I asked you guys to uh, comment four random ingredients. Decided to go with uh, Rich and Joe's idea, which was potatoes, cheese, sausages, and the last one's a bit of a wild card, apple. This is our cutting board here. It's an old stump that we found. Really should have brought some sauce or something, but uh, I don't have any. <laughs> Hopefully the apple gives enough flavor. So we'll give this a uh, try here. It actually turned out better better than I thought. <laughs> yeah. The apple actually is a nice touch. Um, I don't have any sauce, so it actually adds a little bit of sweetness. All right, my dad's gonna try it now. He'll be the real judge. And his twin brother. <laughs> it's a spot. Mm -hmm. Now the apples were the good. Yeah, so this was actually uh, gooder than I thought it'd be. We all agree. It was pretty good. <laughs> Thanks again, uh, Rich and Joe, for the meal suggestion. All right, time for Scout to do the dishes. Leave it. Okay. Scout's been going on it for five minutes. There's some stuff there that she's trying to get. She takes her job real seriously. Hey Scout, you're a good girl. <laughs> you're trying to get the pan clean, eh? My uncle came and burnt down his whole house over here, so. <laughs> we'll see if my shelter survives this, uh, Massive fire right beside it.
starting to get cozy in here. I'm gonna shove this stick at the back of the igloo and we'll see how much room he has to dig. So we'll take a look over here. And we'll just wait for the stick to poke through. Keep going. Okay, well, since we didn't see the stick at all, I think that means we've got a lot of digging left that we can do. Oh, there we go. You guys see that? That's a stick right there. I think that's as far as it'll go. I think this is about as big as it'll get. That's what she said. Oh, good girl. You like it in here? <laughs> oh, good girl. I am planning on doing an overnighter in either this one here, if it's still standing next weekend, or, um, or possibly building another one. We're running out of daylight, so I think I'm going to have to quit recording real soon. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. And as well, I'm always open to recipe suggestions. So, as always, thank you for watching. Peace out. What do you think of that, Scout? What do you think of that? <laughs> we did her. <laughs>